guys, what's up, it's Ella. Welcome back to my channel, and today I am kayaking by myself for the first time. I'm alone in a kayak in the middle of a lake, and I can't paddle and vlog at the same time, so right now I'm just drifting through the wilderness. This is just a local forest preserve near me, and they have kayak rentals. <laughs> it's, it's very difficult to vlog when you're in a kayak. This is just convincing me to buy a GoPro. But anyways, this is my first time kayaking alone. I went canoeing also here like two days ago. So that is my only like non-motor boat experience. Um, but this is like a really beautiful spot. It's very serene, lots of sounds of nature. Um, and they have canoes, kayaks, double kayaks, paddle boats, and they have fishing boats as well. Um, so hopefully I'll see some cool critters. If not, it'll just be me sitting and talking in a boat. But yeah, I'm having a great time so far and I'm excited to take you guys along with me. I'm pretty sure that's a great blue heron just out here chilling I'm trying to get as close as I can without oh there he goes not gonna lie this is not the direction I really wanted to go in um, I was heading the other way but I saw it the awesome bird. I was hoping to get maybe some photos, but I just turned on the camera right away um, for, for the vlog, but that was awesome. There's a lot of really cool wildlife. There's some other real, like large white birds that if I research when I get home, I will let you know what they are. I don't know if they're egrets or storks or another kind of heron. Hopefully I'll figure it out because there's a ton of them. They got these orange beaks and they're they're hanging out in like these marshy areas, like the one behind me. There's not any there right now, but there's a lot of them. So hopefully I'll be able to get a little bit closer to maybe some of those too. In that tree, there's another one of those birds that I will hopefully figure out what they are when I get home. Oh yeah, he's just chilling up there. And I believe there was like a duck over here somewhere. Yeah, he's over there. Really a lot of birds on this lake. I also saw, I think it was this bird, some kind of bird that looked duck-like, that was like diving into the water. Um, they do rent fishing boats here as well, so I'm assuming there's some decent fishing around here. But yeah, right now I'm just, just drifting in the kayak, trying not to lose my paddle while I'm vlogging. It's a Tuesday when I'm out here, so the lake is pretty quiet. The last time I was here was on a Sunday. It was a little bit busier being a weekend, but it still wasn't terrible. But this is really peaceful. Great to be out here in nature, even though there's like skyscrapers over there. I love how like the sky is just reflecting onto the water right now. It's a really beautiful day, great weather. Really cool clouds. I feel like the clouds are looking awesome today and the way that they just like vanish into the reflection is so beautiful. Here's a closer look at one of those birds. You can kind of see there's like a different layer of plant on the water. I'm like, I might have to stop this video because I'm getting kind of close to this part over here, but that's like super gunky and it's hard to paddle through. But yeah, that bird's just chilling on there. Hopefully I won't have to do too much yakking through <laughs> through the swampy areas but i want to explore this part of the lake a little bit more last time i didn't really go over here a ton so who knows maybe i'll find something cool all right well i think i am probably going to start heading back towards the boathouse now i've been out here for about an hour probably like a little bit under an hour but by the time i get to the boathouse it'll probably be around a true hour um and i had a great time on my little kayak here in this lake if you're wondering if you should go kayaking for the first time i would definitely recommend it it was so much fun it's a good workout you get to be outside in nature my first time i did like any paddling i was canoeing i did think canoeing was a little bit more difficult because the boat is larger and it's a bit harder to 
navigate it when there's like other people in your boat but then you do get extra hands at paddling so it does make the paddling a bit easier this really wasn't too bad i'm not like the strongest person in the world but i didn't really have too many issues um navigating myself around the lake it does really take a lot out of your back and shoulders so if those are like areas where you're kind of sore probably not the best activity but it was a ton of fun totally recommend and a great thing about this lake in particular too is that there's not really any currents that you have to deal with where like if you're going down a river that's a bit tougher to navigate so even though i mean i'm really like in the middle of the suburbs there's like a giant road right there the highway is like right over that way so i'm not super like secluded or far out in nature or anything but i still had a great time and it's just nice to get away from concrete yeah even though it's you know just like a suburban lake it's still a great beginner lake not really any currents to deal with and it's local it's convenient i'll definitely try to come out here and do some more paddling or maybe who knows maybe i'll even see if there's any other local places I could check out because as much as I do like the convenience of this location it would be really fun to check out like some other bodies of water nearby or even not nearby I don't know I don't think I'm like sold on like becoming a pro kayaker and going on specific paddling trips but I will definitely be coming out to do this again so thank you so much for watching this video I'm really excited to start expanding my content to some more other activities as much as i love roller coasters i think i'm i'm just a little burnt out on them so i'm happy to start expanding my vlogs to some other activities of mine thank you so much for watching leave a like if you like this video comment i don't know your thoughts on kayaking your thoughts on the new content to the channel that's not completely all roller coasters. I am interested to hear what you guys think about that because i am trying to keep it in like the general realm of travel but yeah, now I'm just rambling. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Adios.